Hey guys, if you like this video, consider subscribing or checking us out on Patreon. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. You're not inside with the others? Catch on. Yeah, no. I see. I just wanted to watch the snow fall for a while. You know, I think it's really nice you're here with me. Yeah. Hey Deku. What? I got this for you. Since it's Christmas and stuff. Just take it already, you damn nerd. Can I open it? What? Of course you can. It's yours. Kachan, what are you saying? You probably think it's dumb anyways. It's true, you really don't have to say that. I mean I didn't even know what to get anyways. So if you don't like it or think it's dumb, it's fine. I probably shouldn't have given you that stupid present in the first place. Because it's from you. It's the most beautiful present I've ever gotten. If I compare the way he looks up at me. Hey, are you really in love with me? It's been a few months since we graduated and begun dating. I was so happy when I realized he felt the same way. But, I can't say things are going very smoothly. I haven't heard from him in a week. That's not a good sign, is it? And of course this is when we don't see each other at work at all either. I can't seem to find the right opportunity. Is this good timing or bad? Is this just how we drift apart? You've gotta be kidding. Are you really in love with me? I'm going to sleep. What? Kachan, hey. It's too early. Er, um, never mind. Of course I know he'd never just be honest and tell me, but we started dating went out places together for the first time, kissed for the first time. And I thought maybe, we'd be taking the next step soon. Did I do something and not realize it? I'm pretty sure he doesn't yell at me as often anymore. Compared to how we used to be, I thought we'd gotten much better about being open and communicating with each other. We should just sit down and talk this out now. But we've both always been bad at bringing things up. What do I do? Are we going to go back to how we were before? Relax, don't worry about it. We're not those people anymore. Kachan, how long have you been here? You should have told me. Wait, did you text me? But I didn't get any new messages. I freaking knew it. Huh? If you're in love with me, why the heck do you look like that? When I touch you, your face and your eyes go all stiff. I had no idea, that's just me being surprised. The heck it is. You're obviously scared. Just like you used to be.
let's go inside and talk, okay? Oh, yeah. You must be freezing. I'll go turn the heat on. Talk. Um, I didn't realize it showed on my face. When you suddenly get close to me, or reach out for me. I guess maybe old habits die hard. I know we're not the people we used to be anymore. In my head I know it's not like that anymore. But I can't help wondering if this relationship is going to end in another rejection too. So I'm still worried, and scared I guess. Yeah, that doesn't freaking sound like you're in love with me. That's not what I'm saying. You're saying it serves me right, aren't you? Don't beat around the bush. He's being down on himself. I doubt you'd appreciate me trying to cover for you, so I won't deny it. I can tell from watching your expression. You're not annoyed at me. You're annoyed at yourself. It's alright. I love you, Kachan. While you've been worrying about that, I've been over here hoping you would finally go all the way next time. What? I know, I got a little carried away. I was just, so happy that you felt the same way, and I wanted to feel connected to you, and chase all these worries away. I do appreciate how much you care about this, and it would be cruel to ask for more from you now. I can't promise that I'll be able to forget about it. But I want to make so many new memories with you, that I don't even think about it anymore. So you just want me for my body? Don't say it like that. Shut up, if you're asking for it that much, then I'm not stopping anymore. Better get used to me giving it to you. Oh my gosh, he's never this mushy. Hey, were you drinking before you came here? The heck? Check for yourself. No alcohol. Okay, sorry it was cold, I never turned the heat on. Cold? Bet you don't notice it now. We're making memories, just like you wanted. What are you grinning for, creepy dork? Don't sit there watching me with that stupid face. Just admiring how cool you looked in that last battle. See it's on TV up there. And you know, you've built a good relationship with the seniors. One of them was talking about how you seemed down recently. I'm gonna blow those dimwits up. Whoa, there are seniors. Come on, they're nice people, they were worried about you. Screw that. Anyway. Where the heck are we going today? You never told me. We're not going out anywhere special this time. After everything that happened the other day, I realized maybe it's because we've been stuck around each other for so long. We've always known too much about each other, and that means we don't really talk to each other that much anymore. So today I thought we could go out, and talk about what's going on in our lives right now. What the heck does going on mean? Like we can talk about stuff that happened at work, or things we're really into recently. If that's all we're doing, why did we bother going out? Because if we're at home, you always change the subject and we never get anywhere. Uh, Kachan? You don't look so happy sometimes. So I thought I'd give you my all my doll, since he always makes me happy. Stupid Deku, why would I want a piece of trash like this? Hope you enjoyed!